welcome to, to today's workshop on crafting effective outlines for academic writing while performing alongside AI. We are excited to introduce you to a unique experience today, a rapid design workshop where we will not only explore traditional outlining technique but also see how AI can assist us in the process. Outline are the backbone of any well-structured uh, uh, academic paper. They help us organize our thought into a logic flow and ultimately make the writing process more efficient. Today we are going to dive into how you can quickly and effectively create this outline. This workshop is designed to be interactive and hand-on. I encourage you to participate actively and try out the techniques as we go along. The goal is for you to leave here with practical strategy that you can apply immediately in your own academic writing. We would also like to take a moment to thank the Learning and Student Success Unit at the University of Ottawa Library for supporting this workshop. They play a crucial role in helping students succeed academically and today's session is a testament to their commitment. Let's get started. Today we would like to highlight the University of Ottawa position on the use of artificial intelligence AI in our courses. First, it's important to, to, to note that whether and how AI is integrated into a course is entirely at the discretion of the professor. This allows for flexibility, ensuring that each course can be tailored to its specific needs and objectives. Second, if AI tools are permitted in a course, it is crucial to carry clearly define the context in which they can be used, particularly in evaluations. This clarity ensures that all students have a shared understanding of what is expected and permissible. Finally, we actively encourage in the innovation use of AI when it has the potential to enhance the learning experience. For more detailed information on this topic, including the guideline and expectation, we recommend visiting the University of Ottawa Academic Integrity page at the link provided on this slide. Let's take a quick look at our agenda for today's workshop. First, we will start by analyzing some academic writing work outline example. This will help us yeah, give us a sense of what e effective outline look like and how they contribute to well-organized academic papers. Next, we will, we will drive into some basic principles on how to craft effective outline for academic writing. We will walk you through the key strategy and tip that will help you structure your thought and idea in a clear and logical way. After that, we will get into the exciting part, performing alongside AI. We will demonstrate how AI can assist in the outlying process, make it faster and more efficient. So you will see how these two can complement your own skill and enhance your productivity. Finally, we engage in a rapid design exercise. This is where you will get hand-on experience applying what we have covered. You will create your own outline using both traditional method and AI too. It's going to be an interactive and practical session, so get ready to dive in. By the end of this workshop, you will have a solid understanding of how to create effectively outline and how AI can be valuable to in your academic writing process. Let's start by analyzing some academic writing outline example. We want you to take a moment to look at the following example and think about them critically. What do you think about this outline? Do they seem effective for, to you? Remember, 
there is no right or wrong answer here. Outline can take different form depending on the writer approach, the topic, and the specific requirement of the paper. What's important is to identify the stench and the weaknesses of each example so we can understand what makes outline truly effective. Example 1. Exap example 2. Example 3. Now, let's move on to understand some basic principles for crafting effective outline in academic writing. First, let's talk about clarity of purpose. It's crucial that your outline clearly reflect the purpose of your assignment. This clarity will guide the direction of your writing, ensuring that every section of your paper align with your main objective. Next is hierarchy and structure. Organize your idea hierarchically, starting with your main points, following, following them with sub points. This structure helps maintain logic flow of idea, making it easier for you, reader, to follow your agreement. Then we have balance and proportions. In your outline, make sure to allocate more time and space to your major point while give less to the minor point. This balance will ensure that your most important idea get the attention they deserve. Another key principle is visualization. Using visualization techniques such as mind maps or concept diagram can be incredibly helpful. Not only do they help you to see the relationship between idea and section more clearly, but they are also make it clear easier for your professor or teaching assistants to understand your outline structure as a grant. Finally, let's discuss the inclusion of supporting evidence. And under each main point in your outline, including supporting evidence, our example, this will strengthen your agreement and provide credibility to your work. Remember, make a good use of resources like journal articles, academic books, and conference proceedings are available to the Ottawa Library. By following those pins, this principle, you will be able to craft outlines that are clear, logical, and persuasive in setting a strong foundation for your writing. Uh, academic writing. As we move into the performing alongside AI section, we will explore how AI can be effective partner in your academic writing process. First, you can use AI to generate a list, list of relevant topics and subtopics based on your research question. This can help you identify areas you may not have considered and broaden the scope of your explorations. Next, AI can assist in suggesting a uh, logical structure for your academic papers. This might include providing different ways to organize your argument, evidence, and analysis, helping you to see potential path that your paper that you, you might not have initially thought of. Once again, the AI has provided its suggestion. The real work begins. You will need to select and refine the most relevant idea and customizing the suggested structure to fit the specific need of your paper. Remember why AI can offer valuable input. Your critical thinking and expertise are what will ultimately shape your academic work into something unique and meaningful. Here is an example where we ask ChatGPT to gener generate a list of relevant topics and subtopics based on our research question about why academic libraries are important for undergrad students. This can help you identify areas that you may not have cons consider and bother broaden your scope of explorations. 
then we ask ChatGPT to assist in suggesting, suggesting logical structure for our academic paper. Again, this might include providing, providing different ways to organize your agreements, evidence, and analysis, helping you to see potential path that for your paper that you might not have in initially initiatively th thought of. Once again, the AI has proved its suggestion. The real work begins. Remember, why AI can offer valuable input. Your critical thinking and expertise are what will ultimately shape your academic work into something unique and meaningful. In this final section, we will drive into a hand-on activity that will put your skill to the test. You will be asked the target to with the design outline for a mock written exam uh, assignment on the benefit and or harm of using ChatGPT for under undergrad students. You will have 15 minutes to complete this task, so work quickly and efficiently. Once you have completed your outline, take a photo of it with your mobile phone. This will allow you to share your work easily and keep a record of your design. Finally, we will come together to present and discuss your writing outline designs. This will be an opportunity to see different approaches and get feedback from your peers. Remember, this exercise is not just about creating an outline, but also about thinking critically and creatively under time constraints. This concludes our workshop video. Thank you for your attention and active participations.